we are going to continue with the second part of the uh, question set for the grade 3 post of DHS uh, which was basically for the post of health educator statistical assistant LDA junior assistant and computer so we left at the question 50 now we are going to continue after that so uh, friends please like share and comment on my videos and uh, in case of any doubts please do share your comments on the, my video and uh, do subscribe so that you get more updates on my next video okay so please follow for your exams so next question that we have is question number 51 which is the small bats can fly at in the dark with the guidance of so which option it will be the answer is d which is ultrasonic sound waves generated by them okay 52 question is why is the flash of lightning seen before the sound of thunder is heard so the answer here is option c because light travels faster than okay question number 52 is why is the flash of lightning seen before the sound of thunder is heard so the answer here is option c which is because light travels faster than sound which we all know that light is the is faster than sound 53 question is which of the following is responsible for clothing of blood so here the answer is none other than platelet option b next question 54 is minus 40 degree celsius is equivalent to which option it's d minus 40 degree fahrenheit so there is also a formula to bring out this answer so let me know in case you need the formula please comment and i will more most likely i will share the answer with you okay next question 54 is minus 40 degree celsius is equivalent to which option it's d minus 40 degree fahrenheit so there is also a formula to bring out this answer so if you need that formula and and you if you would like to understand how to solve this question so please drop your comments and i will be more than glad to answer you back so let's move to the next question the next question is 55 hepatitis is a disease of the so it is a disease of the liver option a next question is 56 liver secrets what does a secret it secret bile option d so next question is so 57 question is endocrine glands these are basically ductless glands so it's option b they do not have ducts 58 question is vitamin b1 deficiency leads to it leads to very very option a this is quite a common question which comes up in most of the exams so please do remember it's very very the answer is next question is 59 the decimal the chemical uh, symbol of copper is it's a very easy question the answer is c copper next question 60 is which of the following is not true about diethyl ether so the answer is it's b it is inflammable it's one of the characteristic of this compound okay so next let's move to the next question 61 question is 61 pituitary gland is a part of which system it's it's endocrine system next question 62 red blood cells are produced in the c it's bone marrow 
Next question is 70. Nerve cells are called as neuron. This is the option is the correct answer. Next question 71 is the synonym of recalcitrant is the synonym of recalcitrant. Synonym is basically the same meaning of this word. So it's none other than obstinate. Option C is the answer. So recalcitrant meaning is basically it's a it's someone or some uh, someone who is impossible to be uh, ruled upon. Okay, so you cannot basically set a uh, type of rules or instructions. You know, you, you cannot control that particular person. So the answer, the same meaning for that would be obstinate. C. So let's move to the next question. The next question is seventy-two. The antonym of intentional is antonym is basically the the antonym of intention so the opposite of intention will be none other than a which is accidental next question is 73 complete the following english proverb with the correct option so on this question and the sentence is very easy everybody should know it's uh, beggars can't be choosers so choosers is option d this is the correct answer 73 Next question, 74, what is the young one of eagle called? Uh, so it's none other than B, eaglet. Next question is 75, complete the following sentence with the correct pronoun given below. So here, it's uh, the sentence is, I have a friend, dash, can, help. So here the answer will be B, who? So, 76 question is complete the following sentence with the correct pronoun given below. So, the sentence is you will have to pull dash together. So, here the answer is C, yourself. So, you are mentioning yourself. So, the option C will be the correct answer. 77 question is what is the superlative form of shy? So, here the correct answer is option A which is Shyest. Complete the following idiom with the correct option. Uh, what is uh, it's the sentences at the drop of a. So the correct answer is hat. Option B. Next question is seventy-nine. Use the correct determiner to complete the sentence. So here the question is, the sentence is Mount Everest is dash highest mountain in the world. So Mount Everest, it's a proper noun. So you would basically use A, the highest mountain. Option A. The question is, use the correct word to complete the sentence. Nobody has dash to the person. So the correct form will be the correct form of word will be access option d next question 81 the synonym of ponder is ruminate b okay it's the same meaning ponder to think so option b is the correct answer next question is 83 complete oh sorry the next question is 82 the synonym of Insolvent is the answer is C weldy. So it's the antonym of insolvent. The opposite of insolvent is weldy. If weldy means it means uh, rich or owning wealth, then the opposite would be insolvent. Okay. Next question is eighty three. Complete the following English proverb with the correct option. A rolling stone gathers no moss. So, B is the correct answer. Okay. So, next question. Let's move to the next question. What is the opposite gender of stag? So, stag is a deer. So, stag is basically the male 
deer so the female deer will be option d hind okay so next question 85 complete the following sentence with the correct determiner so the answer is please give us dash help so it will be option a sum 86 question is complete the following sentence using the correct preposition so the question the sentence is the spider crawled slowly dash the banister so here the correct answer is along option c 87 what is the plural form of trot trot is a kind of fish small fish so here the answer will be b trot itself 87 next let's move to the next question 88 ATN, what is the superlative of noisy? So it's none other than the option D, which is noisiest. 89. Complete the following idiom with the correct option. A leopard cannot change its dash. So here the correct answer is spots. Option B. Question 90. What is the adverb of terrible? So the option, the correct answer is C, terribly. 91. What must be added to x to the power 4 plus 2x3 minus 2x square and plus x minus 1 so that the resulting polynomial is exactly divisible by x to the power 2 plus 2x minus 3. So we have come to the maths part of the question set. So basically I will just let you know the answer that it does not consume uh, more time by trying to solve the question. So uh, for this, uh, for solving the question, if you need uh, the solving part, please uh, drop your comment and I will personally make another video on the solving part. So in the meantime, I will just share the answer with you all. Okay. So here the correct answer is x minus 2. Okay, next question is 94 and the correct answer for this question is C, 810 rupees and 1350 rupees. The 95 question, uh, the, the answer for the for 95 question is C, which is 24 centif centimeter. Next question, 96. The circumference of a circle is 44 centimeter. What is its area? So and this is found basically on a, a formula. So the correct answer is C, 154 square centimeter. Ninety-seven question. The answer for this question is 120 square centimeter option A. The answer for 98 question is rupees 28.80 pesa option D. 99 question the answer for this question is D 5x minus 4y. Last question 100. The answer for this question is C, option C, 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 which is 6. Okay, so we have come to the end of the questions. So if you have in case any doubts or if you feel that the answer that I have given is not correct, please feel free to drop your comments. And uh, in the meanwhile, I would like to request you again to please like, share and subscribe to my channel for more such of videos to follow up on the exam questions and to get more ideas and updates on the answers that I share. So thank you all. Thank you for watching my video.